All right, we're here with Sam Ross, uh, female Beaver Pride Athlete of the Week. Sam, how does it feel? It feels pretty good. <laughs> Last weekend, you were able to shut out two conference opponents. Uh, kind of walk us through that, how it went uh, for you personally, and then also uh, the BSU defense. Uh, well, BSU defense did an absolutely fantastic job this weekend. Our back line really stepped up and you know played a near perfect game, so it made it a lot a lot easier on me as a goalkeeper to go out there and do what I needed to do. Obviously, uh, one of those wins was St. Cloud State, team that ended you guys the season last year. How good did that feel to on their home field again uh, to be able to shut them out? It felt fantastic. I mean, I think everyone's been waiting for this for a while and. We did, a, we did a really great job overall. So. You host two more conference opponents this weekend. Obviously, two more big games. You can't, you can't take a minute off in the SIC. Uh, what can we expect from this team this, this weekend? I mean, they're both very good teams, and I think they're going to come out really hard. And since we have been doing pretty well, I think they're going to really come out and challenge us. So. All right, congratulations, Andrew Schultz, on the male Beaver Pride Athlete of the Week. Uh, how does it feel? It uh, feels great to be up there with uh, some of the past winners, this crop win and a couple other guys. Uh, obviously, you had a, a great accomplishment last year or this last week, uh, 1,000 career yards. To be able to do that uh, while scoring a touchdown, how, uh, how cool is that for you? Uh, it felt good, you know, to get in there on that 1,000 touchdown. It was a pretty good feeling, a uh, good way to top that number off, I think. Did you kind of know you were that far away um, when you caught it? Do you, you kind of get a feeling that you surpassed the mark? Uh, actually, when I caught it, I was just looking to score a touchdown because I knew I probably wasn't going to be able to get the ball again. So it was a touchdown or just yards on that play, and I was just trying to get six points. You had two touchdowns in the game. Uh, how, did that, how did that second one go? Kind of caught it before the end zone and was able to find a way, find yeah, a way in. I actually, uh, you know, it's my I've been playing here for four years now, and that's my first multi-career touchdown game. So uh, that felt good. Hopefully, I can get a couple more of those this year. What can fans expect from Bemidji State football this coming weekend against Concordia St. Paul? Uh, good defense, good special teams, and hopefully, we can put up points on offense.